Hello, my name is Sandy Ramos, and I'm a maternal fetal medicine specialist here at UC San Diego Health. The reason we think vaccination in pregnancy is important is to help lower the risk of needing to be hospitalized and having a severe COVID infection. Additionally, we know from other vaccines, for example, the flu vaccine and the pertussis vaccine, that the mother's immune response crosses via the placenta to the unborn baby and protects the baby up to a few months. Now, we are still investigating whether this happens with the COVID vaccine, but we're hopeful that this is another way to protect your baby. We know that in pregnancy, women are more susceptible to having a severe respiratory infection. We had learned that with COVID, there's a higher risk of needing to be hospitalized, needing a breathing tube to breathe, and even though it's rare, there is a higher risk of dying as a result of the COVID infection. Therefore, we recommend all pregnant women receive the COVID vaccine. Additionally, we know that women who get COVID during pregnancy have some pregnancy complications. Those include a higher risk of delivering premature, there also seems to be a higher risk of stillbirth and a higher risk of high blood pressure in pregnancy or what we call preeclampsia. As you may be aware, when the vaccine was first introduced, many healthcare workers signed up to get the vaccine first. We now know from a report from the Centers of Disease Control that among 2,000 women, healthcare workers who received the COVID vaccine, there was no higher rate of birth defects, preterm delivery, adverse outcomes in the pregnancy, and the side effects of the vaccine were the same as if you were not pregnant. As I mentioned before with the flu and whooping cough or pertussis vaccines, we know that when those vaccines are administered, the maternal immune response crosses into the breast milk and offers some protection to the baby. Although this is still being studied, we're hopeful that the same can, response can be seen after the COVID vaccine, therefore offering some protection to your baby. If you're planning to get pregnant, we advocate receiving the vaccine. There is currently no biologic plausibility that the vaccine can interfere with fertility, and therefore we recommend you getting the vaccine as soon as you are able to. The Centers for Disease Control are professional organizations such as the American College of OBGYN and the American Pediatric Society and various other professional organizations are recommending vaccination both in pregnancy and during breastfeeding. The current vaccines will not give you the COVID infection as they do not contain live virus. They're actually made up of mRNA that tricks your body into an immune response that therefore protects you very well against having a severe COVID infection. And we hope that this immune response also crosses via the placenta to protect the baby.